Alden. He's a northern seahorse. In the wild, northern seahorses are found in quite a few regions along the coasts of the Caribbean and North and South America. Like all seahorses, Sheldon's life began as an egg. Female seahorses will lay dozens, sometimes hundreds of eggs, where they'll be stored in a pouch on the male seahorse, kind of like a kangaroo, but underwater. As a baby seahorse, Sheldon was known as a fry. He was tiny back then, just about the size of a jelly bean. But now that he's fully grown, he measures about five inches and is a small fry no more. Seahorses get their name from their horse-like head, but make no mistake, Sheldon and the others are actually fish, and unique ones at that. Look closely. With thin skin stretched over bony plates, this guy is all spikes and no scales. Sheldon's fast-moving fins make it possible for him to glide along with more elegance than any pony you might see on land. Sheldon, like every seahorse, has a secret power, the ability to camouflage. He can change to all kinds of colors, depending on his surroundings. Naturally, this makes him very hard to spot, so Sheldon doesn't get bothered much by hungry predators. But that doesn't stop him from hunting down a good meal. Just like other seahorses, Sheldon will ambush his prey and suck in small crustaceans with his snout. But without any teeth to chew his food or even a stomach to hold it, his dinner is digested quickly and Sheldon gets hungry a lot. There's only one thing that Sheldon likes more than food, and that is his mate. Sheldon and his partner will stay together their whole lives. And as a long-standing tradition for seahorses, these two romantic slow dance each morning. Unfortunately, Sheldon's species is listed as vulnerable in the wild. Because this species lives in thick seagrass close to land, they are threatened by pollution, coastal development, and destructive fishing practices. Luckily, though, there are things that you can do to help. By keeping outside areas clean and conserving resources like electricity and water, you can eliminate some of the pollution that endangers these special animals.